Hello to all of you all across the world. I hope all of you are looking after yourselves and looking out for each other. Welcome back to another video. I am not in New Zealand at the moment. I'm actually here in Tyler, Texas, a small little place outside of Dallas. And I'm here filming a story for an adoption story with Katya Reach, who is a Ukrainian American adoptee. Katya, hello. Hello, привет. Привет. It's so nice to be here in America and I've never been to Texas before, so this is really nice. And as you can see, it is winter time, but it's actually quite warm. Why is it so warm? Because it's Texas. And also, everything is bigger and better in Texas. That's what right? they, I hear that all the time. And you are from Kansas as well, so we're not in Kansas City anymore. Kansas! We're not in Kansas anymore. Oh, we're not in anymore. Kansas anymore. <laughs> Anyways, Katya's story is coming out very soon, right here on my YouTube channel. And it'll be episode 7 for Anne Adoption Story. And she's been telling a story right from the very beginning, sitting down with me, telling me about her birth family that she's connected with in Ukraine. And it's also a fun fact too, her birth mother has also connected with my birth father, which makes it a very small world. And this is my first time meeting Katya right here in the States and it's been awesome. It's been a busy few days though putting the story together, hasn't it? Oh yeah, oh yeah. So what are some of the things that we talked about for your story, for an adoption mm. story? Just some of the highlights that we talked about. We discussed about your childhood, growing um, up. Yeah, we talked uh, yeah, about my life, the story from beginning to uh, up to till now and just some highlights in that and uh, my connection with my birth family and even um, what I'm doing now and what I'm studying and how um, psychology informs and um, impacts um, how we are today and informs awesome. our stories. Absolutely, and it's so important to connect those pieces. The family tree, your family history, you're raised in America, you have a great child, you had a great childhood, great family that looked mm -hmm. after you, but also you've got that connection with your Ukrainian roots as well. Mm -hmm. That is so important. So all of that stuff is really all part of every story that we do and share, no matter where you're adopted from. And this is why it's so important to do this because meeting so many adoptees, no matter where you're adopted from or adopted to, it's always so vitally important. I always feel that, always yes. important. And for your connection with Ukraine and you have connected with your birth mother, and we'll get more into this in her story, of course, but I know that it's taken a while to build that those steps connecting with your birth mother, but it's been good. It's mm -hmm. been good, hasn't it? Yes, yeah, so we have a very deep relationship. I think it's so important, mm -hmm. so important. So a fun fact too, Kachi is actually part of my organization I'm Adopted and she has been helping as an editor and contributor and also helping out with our private group which has over 2,000 adoptees in it and it's been really good that you've been able to hear more stories and connect with more adoptees mm -hmm. in that case as well as for you know learning, getting, gaining more experience from hearing other stories. How's it been connecting with the organization and hearing other adoptee stories? Oh, it's been very valuable and priceless. It helps, you know, inform me on a lot of um, different perspectives and even on my own perspective. It's really healing to share um, our journeys and we're even doing that locally through a, a group, a local group that we've started for adoptees. And Alex is going to be a special guest on it for going adoptees today. of East Texas. It's going to be awesome. We're going today, aren't we? And so yes. this is a group that you've set up mm -hmm. for adoptees here in East Texas. And I'm looking forward to that, looking forward to meeting new faces and connecting with more. So. How, how long have you been having this group for now? Well, this is our first time meeting together. First time. In person, yes. Yeah. And first time connecting, it's just the beginning of stages and we're hoping to uh, have for it to grow and to meet more consistently and regularly and just do life together locally, in person. It's so important to have these connections and communities, whether it's in person or online, because this is why we do this and this is why we connect with each other. So her story will be coming up very soon. I've got another four stories I was just I lost count there I got another four stories to do here in America before heading back home and putting them together four or five five all together five all together uh -huh. so it's quite a lot it's gonna be quite busy but also I want to thank all of you as well so much for listening to these stories so far that I've done all I think six stories so far I've lost track a little bit I know. so she'll be number seven so it's gonna be great to put together any last any last remarks about Texas why why we should come to Texas tell us now because I I'm not I'm not from here so <laughs> you need to well everything is bigger and better in Texas as they say? Yes. So thank you all so much for tuning in. I just want to also point out, we've done a lot of takes on this. Um, look after yourselves, <laughs> look out for each other. And until next time, goodbye, Dastadanya. Dastadanya. And what would you like to say? Howdy y'all. Howdy y'all from Texas. Look after yourselves, take care. See you all very soon. Paka. Paka. I also want to say a huge thank you to My Heritage for making this series possible. And if you head over to the website, you can get free shipping for a DNA Family History Kit. Just use the code word I'm Adopted or one word to get your free shipping. Thank you, My Heritage, for making this all possible the connections connecting with each other for adoptees, for their journeys, and for their stories. Thank you all so much.